Yeah, well, here we go again. Get that off. 7.40 p.m. Open Air Log. It's April 17th, 2020. John, we're recording. Yeah. Uh, a few days ago, Small Business Association ran out of money. The federal government had so much earmarked, and a lot of a lot of the money just disappeared. The pork came out to get the money, and they grabbed the money, and they split with the money, leaving everybody else who had paperwork in process. They got nothing. They got nothing at this point. It's like looking at my town at this point over here, asking and pleading for money to get their services going, and yet they can't because the federal government failed, bailed on them. How are they going to feel that their own federal government screwed up on them? They want to make this into a political thing. I'll make it into a political thing. I'll tell them, look, it was your damned banks out there, the people you liked, the people you trusted, the GOP out there that didn't protect your ass, didn't protect your assets. You blame the governor for shutting down the damn state because we had to do it because of the corona spread. You've been hearing some of the horror stories I've been. You've been thinking, oh, it's fake news, fake news. Some of the survivors are coming on the news and giving their stories. They still scream out fake news. I don't want to hear some of those people who keep screaming out fake news. Try to survive when they get the damn bug. And then recant their stories. Basically recant it. It's not going to happen. In several states, restriction had been laxed a little bit. Where people went out and partied. We've also had a lot of demonstrations in states regarding how much this quarantine is is killing people left and right. Besides the virus trying to, uh, virus trying to kill them, it's killing people economically. Businesses are shut down left and right. People are out of work. They can't get the stimulus money just yet. They're waiting for their unemployment. Unemployment's still dragging its ass. People are frustrated, scared, terrified, and no question sure what the hell to do with the creditors and, and bill collectors and stuff. Me, on the other hand, I owe, I owe money. But at least I know how. I'm trying to, I need to pay that back. I don't know how much it is. Just trying to pay it back is a pain in the ass. I have the research to find out the reason why. Once I find out the reasons why, maybe I can get the damn thing fixed, hopefully, and get my payments fixed next week, so I don't have to worry about it. And I also double-checked my records online regarding my Social Security. And finally, got the damn day of fucking birth fixed. And it took them long enough. 